Okay, we're going to look at a couple of different things on this video. The first thing is I want you to see the landing page that I have created for About the Valley just to um, use for training for this class. This is About the Valley. It is a picture of Huntsville. In the video in the lesson, I'm going to walk you through how to build this and how to actually do this overlay on the back. Um, but as you can see, I've got the logo. Does not You can't click on it and go in off of the page five unusual things to do close to home looking for something different to do this summer get our list of unique things to do right in your backyard that's all of the content that's on there because remember my objective with this is to capture their information to just offer something that's going to be enticing enough for them to send me their information in exchange i only have two fields on here and i debated on whether to put the name field on here but when i sent out my automated emails I like to be able to address them personally. So instead of putting a first name and last name and having three fields, I put name. Some people will put their first and last in it. Some will only put their first. So either way, it's fine. <coughs> and then I customize this. I actually uh, meant to change this color on the, when you highlight it. But as you can see, it stands out in the blue and I customized it. Get the list exactly what they're going to get when they click on this. And, you know, looking at some of those examples, I might go back and change that to get the list now. Um, but I did want you to see this. This is an example. And in class, we are actually going to go to this landing page and um, sign up for it just to see what happens. So if you're not in the in-person class, I want you to go to this address, subscribepage.com, about the valley, things to do. Put in your name, your email address, and click on Get the List. It should automatically take you to a page that looks almost just like this. It says, Thank you. You should receive the information you requested in your mail, in mail soon. And then you should get an email right away with the list of five things to do. Um, we're actually going to go. I built this and I created a Facebook add from it we're going to walk through how to do that also in a, another section of this unit but i want to go in and let's look at what i can do with that list now so this is the back end of miller light that i've set up and remember i only put this on um, this um, facebook ad i only put it on late last night so it hasn't had even 24 hours yet but we're going to go in and look um, we're going to click on subscribers and then we're going to look at groups so about the valley landing page i had a few people already on here just from testing it in different alliance meetings but i already have 35 subscribers on here we're also going to go i'm going to pull up my facebook um, and just click on here and ads manager could take a minute for it to come up and we're going to switch over so that we can actually see that one And as you can see, I put a very low limit on this, so it's probably not showing very often. So I don't know what results we've had yet. Okay, so far we have reached 1,200 people. I've spent $10.50. We have had um, 81 unique link clicks. It has cost me 13 cents per landing page view. So all the people that have gone on and viewed the landing page, it has only um, cost me 13 cents per person to see that. And then um, link clicks. I don't know if it shows me on here how many actually filled out the information, but we'll actually see that back on Miller Lite on the landing page. This is the one I created for this particular one. And I know, let's see. Um, this is where it started last night. Let's see. Wait a minute. Uh, yeah. From 
here down was already in the system. So I've had all of these people sign up wanting that list of five fun things to do over the last 24 hours. So that's probably 10, 11 new leads that I've gotten. Um, so that is a great turnaround, especially for one that I've put out with a very limited budget on it. Okay, so with this on the groups, we'll talk more in the next section, but we can actually go in now that we have these people in a group, we can actually go in and set up an automated email that they're going to get a welcome email, informational, not a sales pitch unless they have signed up for a something from the beginning that was a sales pitch. This is to build relationships. So we can start doing a newsletter um, on a set schedule. We can just set up automation that goes out automatically for uh, every week for two months. Take a couple of hours and do that and save a lot of time. But this is giving us new people interested in what we have to offer to grow relationships with.